Migrants being bused from border states into major cities. The mayor of Washington, D.C., now declaring a state of emergency as the city faces a flood of thousands. ABC's Mary Alice Parks is in Washington with the latest. Mary Alice, good morning. Trevor, good morning. Yeah, I'm here in front of Union Station, the main train and bus station here in Washington, D.C. And the Washington, D.C. Mayor, Mariel Bowser, says that over 9,000 migrants have been bused through here this summer alone, sent from Texas and Arizona. Texas has also sent other migrants to New York and Chicago. And Mayor Bowser and other leaders in these Democratic cities just blasting these Republican governors in Texas and Arizona, arguing that they're using people, using these migrants as political pawns. And D.C., like you said, declared a state of emergency this week, opening up about $10 million in funds to help provide housing meals for these migrants as they arrive. A spokesperson from Texas Governor Greg Abbott told us in a statement that they think the true emergency is at our nation's southern border, not in the nation's capital, where small Texas border towns are overrun and overwhelmed, they said. And there was this new video from Texas just this week. Migrants rescued. Uh, they had to swim. There you see it. Swim across this river. Border Patrol agents having to to rescue them. Border Patrol agents pleading with migrants to not risk their lives in these sorts of situations. Now, the D.C. mayor here has asked the federal government for help from the National Guard. But, Janae, so far that help has not arrived. All right, Mary Alice, thank you. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.